No, it was tough. Uh, it's two tie-break sets. Anything can happen, really, and it's nice to play matches like this for a change because it's rare that you play two breakers in one match. And you know, I fought well. I thought it was a you know a difficult match, trying to get some rhythm from the baseline, but we were both really serving well and not giving each other you know many chances. I think I really should have won maybe the second set, uh, you know, a bit easier because I did have Love 40 and a couple more break points down the road. But you know, he did well to to fight off some some break points and then up himself 6-2 in the break. So I got lucky there to come back. Um, but you know, overall, extremely happy. And other finals, it's it's just amazing. It was a great atmosphere out there, wasn't it? Yeah, atmosphere was amazing. Uh, you know, I really enjoyed myself out there. I mean, uh, it's not every day that people get really that much into a match, and obviously, you got to have. Uh, the sort of uh, closeness to the match as well, that the, the people really go crazy and that was the case tonight. And possibly another Dubai title, what is it about here that you seem to enjoy so much? Um, well obviously I do practice a lot here so that helps me maybe when the tournament comes around to know exactly you know, how conditions are but then again the, the draw is so difficult, there was 8 out of top 10 players in the draw so you know, just to make it to the finals is almost a breakthrough for any player here and Murray had to come through Djokovic, I had to come through Del Potro and other good players um, to make it deep into the tournament and now we play for the silverware, that's where I always try to play my very best and uh, I'm excited it's happening here in Dubai. Yeah, and obviously a match against Andy Murray. Um, you've not played him for a year. Where do you think you are in that year? What, what's, has Andy progressed and he's got a new coach? Just, just tell me what you think of him. Yeah, I mean, I would, uh, I would hope for him and I would think he has improved. I mean, he's a, he's a great player. I always thought he's been so talented and really amazing uh, you know, career already, even though he hasn't won a slam. That's kind of what, unfortunately, everybody talks about. But overall, he's been so rock solid, you know, not even close, really, to falling out of top five, really and chances to get to world number two or even number one so he, he's right, right in it and it's, it's a big match for us like you said we haven't played each other in a year it's quite incredible but obviously with Novak stopping both of us at the times it was hard finding each other and uh, so I think it's nice that he did a breakthrough win against Novak and here we go now playing a finals it's, it's great for us. And you, your record against him you've beaten him a few times you've had some real tough battles haven't you? I think he has a winning record over me and uh, you know he makes it difficult we've had some good matches over over the years uh, but like uh, you know like I said I think we haven't played each other for a long time now so difficult conditions it's quick we haven't played um, he had a lot of changes also in his coaching staff and so forth so we'll see how he plays this time around but I expect him to be aggressive not like back in the day when he used to stay back and sort of wait for things to happen now his serve is much improved and he can really play really well off the baseline and he can absorb pace really well so it's it's a nice matchup I like the matches against him because they're tactical and, and a bit different than the usual ones yeah he was very aggressive to go against Djokovic do you think he's changed that kind of side of his game um, well, I mean, here in Dubai you have to be aggressive, so there's almost no way around that. Otherwise, you're going to be always the one defending, and it's too hard defending here in Dubai and, and then coming time and time again out of those tough positions. Uh, but overall, I think also he has played more aggressive. Even at the end, sort of one and a half, two years ago, when I played him in Toronto and I think Shanghai, when I lost both finals against him, he was playing aggressive. So I kind of know what to expect, but then again, different day, different year, anything could happen, really.